That's why we here. That's why I'm here. Police the police. They have to. That's the only way. Because when the people come out, they talk about now they can use live ammunition. They shooting motherfuckers on their porches. Ooh, Trump talk about sicking dogs on motherfuckers. We did. We kneeled from a black person perspective. We kneeled. We rode the buses. We stayed silent. We had sit-ins. We sat at the count at the uh, fucking counters. We let motherfuckers take us to jail, believing that the system worked. We've done, please, if somebody, somebody out here, if you know one thing that black people haven't done to not get fucked off, us just go, just stay at home. Just stay at home, brother. They just killed the chick in her house. Yeah. They was lawful, law-abiding citizens. The cops killed her in her house. They charged her boyfriend with a tent murder on the cop. You can't talk on your cell phone. You can't reach for a wallet. They killed dude for playing the trumpet. <laughs> Motherfucker was talking on himself on his backyard. What the one do back in the day? They shoved the plunge up his, up his ass in New York. Yeah, I'm gonna do Diallo. Sean Bell, they killed him the night before his wedding. It's not everybody and it's not white people all the time. It's that fucked up mentality. This ain't just start in America. Y'all in college, a lot of y'all, you know history. Look at history, it's fucked up. Not just here in America, all around the world, it's been fucked up. But today's a new day. We sure can enough. consciously change this shit. It's we right. can send out that white light to the universe. Right. I ain't never, I'm from bed stuff fucking Brooklyn. The fuck I'm talking about some white light? <laughs> you. That's real though. That's right. That connection, that humble love, that Eureka love, even though it's rough love. <laughs> fucking Arcata love. But when you leave from out here, you go to McKinley. Y'all know what they call it up there. Yeah. We got an oasis right here. While you chilling in this oasis, don't take it as a vacation. Oh, school's out, fuck it, I'm partying. Oh, work's out, fuck it, I'm chilling. Nah, educate yourself. Grow those gardens. Pass this knowledge on to your peoples back east, north, south, wherever the fuck. They made it illegal in certain states to buy seeds. They said seeds are weren't essential in the springtime. How the fuck are, spring, are seeds essential? They know they don't want it to happen, y'all. Yep, they want to control. We got all this shit going on, whether it's man-made, man whether it's man-made corona, or it's some real corona shit. We know statistically proven they saying that a second wave is gonna hit, whether you believe the shit or not. We know that people aren't working in the fields. We know that people aren't working like that. The meat packing plants, everything's about to start going a whole nother way. Look at them. Y'all see what happened when it first kicked off? The stores was getting emptied out. They ain't telling us to prep for the fall, for the winter. That's what we really need to be focusing on with the bullshit that's happening as well. Don't lose sight, people. We been getting dropped. We shouting, we know we fucking matter. Do your history. They ain't, li well, at least me, they ain't lying to me. I know this wasn't our land. I studied the shit out of history. History. Check out Ivan Van Sertima, if you want a fucking author. Or Ivan Van Sertima, however you want to pronounce it. This man changed the game, history-wise. We have been duped. We have been lied to. That's right. On so many levels. But how the fuck can we overcome that shit if we don't know any better? It's history, and then you got his story. What are we learning in school? History? Or his story. Sometimes you gotta step outside that classroom to get that education. That's facts. 
Oh it's a poet. I'm going to spit this and then I'll let y'all go so I ain't jacking the mic. This guy named Saul Williams, it ain't even my shit. My shit, I'm at you. Fuck it up. Saul Williams, in a movie called Slam, it's one of the realest joints I've ever seen. Slam. Slam. He's out selling weed, not to give away the plot of the movie, if any of y'all check it out. But fuck it. He gets caught up in the system and he just wants to make music, you know? And he's just ex he's extremely good, and this is his poem. My favorite. Check it out. If I could find a spot where truth echoes, I would stand there and whisper memories of my children's futures. I would let their futures dwell in my past so that I might live a brighter now. Now is the essence of my domain, and it contains all that was and will be. Because I am as I was and always will be, that nigga. I am that nigga. I am that nigga. I am that timeless nigga that swings on pendulums through minds of minds of booby trap minds that are enslaved by time. It was me which supersedes lifetimes I am. It was me with serpentine hair and an immortal glare turned immortal fair into stone time capsules. They still exist as a seven matriarch and head Medusa. I am. I am that nigga. I am that nigga. I am a Negro, yes, Negro meaning necro, meaning death. I overcame it, so they named me after it. And they be putting kick me signs on death's back because I am not the son of sh clack clack. I am before. I am before before. Before death is eternity, after death is eternity. There is no death, there is only eternity. And I'll be riding on the wings of eternity like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She clack clack. But time keeps beating my ass. Time makes dreams defer. So all of my day mans are turning into nightmares of ones who's haunting my past. She clack clack. Time is beating my ass. And I be having dreams of chocolate covered watermelons filled with pieces of fried chicken wings. <laughs> and Aunt Shemima and Uncle Ben are standing there also in my dreams. And there's children hitting the watermelons trying to catch the pieces of fallen fried chicken wings. <laughs> and Aunt Shemima and Uncle Ben are also standing there with rifles pointed at the heads of the children. Don't shoot the children, I shout. Don't shoot the children. But they say that it's too late. This shit is before my time. It's before my time. I need more time. But they start shooting the children and killing them. One by one, two by two, three by three, four by four, five by five, six by six, seven by seven. But my spirit is growing. Seven by seven, God number. Because seven heaven. light only penetrates the darkness. That's already there. And I'm already there. I'm here at the end of the road, which is the beginning of the road beyond time, but where my niggas at? Oh, don't tell me my niggas got lost in time. My niggas are dying before their time. My niggas are serving time. My niggas are dying because of time. All we got in this world, y'all, is this little bit of time. Don't let nobody try to take your life force. Yes. Period. Yes. You shouldn't. Imagine somebody trying to kill you every day. That's how we feel. Just imagine that. Now imagine that we your killer. Or you that killer. Put yourself in them shoes. Take yourself out of them shoes. Be that healer. Be that provider. Try, 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 and if we can't, then it is what the fuck it is. And we can't never say that we ain't try. Yeah. That's it. Thank you.